All right, so let me go just real quick. So, um, a while ago, well, maybe an hour or two or a couple hours ago, I did a live earlier on, which I deleted the live because it was kind of all over the place because I was just so disturbed by a lot of things that I heard. You know, I was just, you know, I was just shaken, you know, and disgusted, you know, disappointed in some of the things that I was hearing, you know, about, um, about a particular person and i usually call names and i don't know why all of a sudden we don't really want to call names it's just because i don't really want to get involved and i want to figure you know um but if you know you know right um the last time i did a video i said leave the diaspora alone leave the diaspora alone not knowing that the diaspora is draining you know you're gonna get your name you know dragged you know, it's a your name I got just seen at some corner and some places where it not belong, right? And before you know it, you're going you know, you know, to ruin your know, reputation. And for what? It's just not worth it. And as somebody said the last time, no, we are hearing all types of things about this individual who is meant to be a professional person, a person of high calib caliber, right? Um, upstanding citizen, you know, and you to me it's like you mash up your career to me you mash up your your your, your, your reputation really and truly for what over what so me tell me say Le um, hey see me come out and say look here man on oh, no, several ties with people if you know a blog, you know just blog. You see this friend and company thing on on social media? In a on a diaspora, it don't make no sense. Believe me what I'm telling you. Leave it alone. Keep on yourself to on yourself. This one on a keep on yourself to on yourself. Nobody can call on and tell you about nothing at all. Because you don't entertain certain things. You don't interested in certain things. If this is one topic out there and you want to talk about it, you come and you talk about it. Don't place yourself in a position where you, 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 you can't talk about the topic because you're going to seem as if you are a traitor, you are a hypocrite, you are a backbiter, you are this and that. You may not tell you, no? No one, no, no, no. Hmm? Where you not to come out and be biased? I never want to know about them somebody. I never tell you to no stop divulge information about you know, one another because when he, shit hit the fan, you know, go hear no business out there, out that street. John Public, I go hear what did I talk about and what did I talk about and stuff like that. I don't know, listen. But when I bought a moon, I had fun. 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 I But the fact of the matter is that no matter how I tell you, no, whether I tell you no harsh, what I'm telling on a soft, what I'm telling on a nice, what I'm polish it up and give wrap it for them. The truth is just the flipping truth. This is just the stone cold truth, the hard truth. It's just the hard truth. I always tell on the hard truth. They give it to you. Hmm? See there? And I see that play out. I mean, those the persons that go say, oh, you're one to talk. I did nothing. I did absolutely nothing. You hear me, Salono? So, I don't want to come on my page come say, Oh, you want to talk because you did it. Did, did. No, the thing is that I'm not an idiot. I'm not an idiot. I've been reading the room. You look here, I study social media, I study people. When you spend time in my spare time, I just sit down and watch and observe. I study people, I analyze it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'm not a fool. <laughs> so I got to say education I have nothing to do with common sense. Because you see in this case, common sense is just lacking. But then again I was thinking about something and I'm thinking to myself like, you know, I know and I said I'm common sense, you know. On the hurt. On the hurt. Some of we go through some stress. Some of we are carry on, we are carry on some big heavy burden. Yes, we are burdened with problem, with stress. 
and through we don't know how to deal with it, we project it onto others. It manifests in, in other ways. And you see these ways that it's been manifested in, it can affect us, it can bite us in our ass. That's why I always champion for therapy. We don't need to go and seek therapy. Go and seek therapy. No found no suffer. No found the day I suffer and suffer in a silence. Go and seek therapy. We mind need fixing. We need help. Yeah. We brain need help. Mm-hmm. And the sooner I wanna fix it, and the better it is going to be for everybody. Trust me. I feel sorry for someone no, truly truly. I'm going to tell you something. I don't know if you give the social media a break sometimes, you know. Give social media a break. Good God, man. Put on the phone. Go to the park. Walk in at the park. Inhale. Exhale. Spend some time with the children and the grandchildren. Play. You run up and down and go on like a play some board games, some card games. You know, do homework. You know? It's, you know set some you know you have a list of words you know call a little grand picnic them i want to pick them and sit down and say make them you know spend, occupy on the time occupy on the time watch some movies yeah watch some movies you know so sometimes we're in at the phone more entertaining but me i tell you nothing know, you see this phone thing here yeah? oh my god this social media can consume you know and you know good for your mental health Believe me to God, it is so nice when I not put on the phone. Men will say, yes, we use it for make money, but sometimes just put it down. Put it down. Some of we not even, we not get no good sleep at night time. We not get no good sleep at night time because we dip on the phone 24-7. It's true. As soon as we wake up in the morning, we pick up the phone. We barely can say we prayer. Put on the phone. Put on the phone, man. And do something with the little kiddies. Go and pamper yourself. Like this weekend now. Me, me, me and my daughter, we're going to pamper ourselves. We're just going to spend the day together and just, you know, have lunch. You know, we're just going to go to the spa. And just treat yourself nicely. Just look after ourselves. No phone. You know, just... We're just going to enjoy with one another. company and just, you know, do a look of walking around in London. And do a look of spot of shopping. You know? And life for the feel you know? Life for the Philip. I mean, I talk about the people them who are big bone because you know, so sometimes when them need the little, you know, excitement and so you know, they look where they may understand. And I talk about them when they talk about like the one that were proper able bodied, you know, you know, in our profession, I want to put on a profession, you know, and a reputation at stake and in jeopardy, on a destroy on self for social media, on a different, on a different. But when we come out and talk about them sitting there, them something here, I'm going to drag my fire, so I go to Timbuktu. My granny said, if you can't hear, how do we feel? And now that I see I take place in a social media, you think I don't study social media, I don't study it. And I say, yeah, man, I don't hear, I don't hear, how do we feel? Mm -hmm. Feel it, I feel now. You have to feel it. It's going to affect you. Hmm?